This Leadership Academy brings 20 people together from all over the country and another country in Canada and allows us to collaborate and make ourselves better for the good of our agencies. I wanted to learn different leadership styles and try to understand what my leadership style was. But everyone has their own distinct uh, kind of leadership style uh, that's driven by life experiences and that that has a profound impact on the way that we interact with one another, whether it's another leader or our staff or you know folks that we're interacting with on a day-in and day-out basis. Um, it's great to get this leadership knowledge um, related to motor vehicles, but then also just to meet other future leaders in the motor vehicle administration world and to learn from them and build connections that will benefit in the future. I've, I've learned so much that it's scary. I learned that my leadership style is not as um, rare as I thought I was. There's plenty of people that have the same leadership style, so that feels good to know, you know, there's other people out there. There's a lot of things that I knew I needed to work on, and this has really brought it to the, brought it to uh, the surface, um, including letting myself be vulnerable, um, delivering bad news, um, some of the things that I kind of knew subconsciously I, I avoided and, and wasn't good at, um, but this has really brought it to the forefront and showed me how important some of those things are that I need to work on. Uh, I think the group has been fantastic. Uh, everybody's been interacting with one another. Um, it's just been picking up conversation after conversation with everybody that's here. Uh, everybody seems to be willing to share. It seems like we are, we've been knowing each other forever. We've become a little family now. It's been better than expected. Um, these, these are going to be relationships I'll be using um, and, and uh, benefiting from for years. The group itself really is cohesive, has come together. Um, it's basically become one big team, so it's been, it's been really nice actually. This is one of the most rewarding things outside of joining the United States Army that I've ever done, so I would tell anyone who's thinking about it, don't think about it, do it. I think the biggest resource that we bring back is the connections that we make through this opportunity. Um, learning that you know, we all have similar issues and we're all facing them a different way, so it's been great to make these connections. Um, and I know that there's certain people that I'm already going to reach out to as soon as I get back. I, I know initially I was a little scared because it seems like, you know, am I ready for it? Am I really, you know, at that point in my career that I'm going to go here, you know, come to a place like this? And I'm happy I had the support and people to tell me, yes, you are, go do it. I've learned that things aren't always what they seem to be in our state specific. And I can relate to a lot of the other states. The conversations, uh, those are resources, invaluable resources and indefinite resources. Um, I can always reach out, so uh, take those back with me and, and keep the growing learning.